cowabunga it is then. I guess we're just gonna explore. Well, onward and upwards, I guess. That man, his form was changed. It was as though that lance was swallowing him whole. And that's some Princess Mononoke Miyazaki shit. Right, it makes sense that your students were upset. I mean, I wonder if those relics truly hide such power. It's interesting for sure. But even still, that power seems familiar. That form as well. As one who wields the sword of the creator, does that mean you possess that power too? I hope not. <laughs> Professor, and I would be a you monster. The goddess is indeed generous with her divine protection. I have already heard Gilbert's report about what Happy happened. Now. See to it that you keep what transpired at the tower to yourself. What? People Why? People lose faith in the nobles should rumors spread of one using a relic and transforming into a monster. All Ooh. regions of Fodland would fall into chaos. We must avoid that at all costs. So we're just gonna Please lie to them? The students who accompanied you understand that as well. Have I made myself clear? Can I object to this? Um... If I do, she's gonna be angry at me. Yes, of course. His transformation into a black beast was nothing short of divine punishment from the goddess. Punishment for someone arrogant and foolish enough to use a hero's relic even though they were unworthy and unqualified. You... you knew? Of course. That is why we rushed to recover it. Sadly, we did not arrive in time. The church will formally return the lance to House Gautier, if you would. As you wish. You have my gratitude. I can see that I was right to trust you with this. I feel Please like this will bite that, me in the ass later. I will tell you of your new mission for the coming moon at that time. Is your meeting over, Professor? Yes. You look troubled, Dimitri. I was just thinking about something. Professor, the possession of relics and crests has been highly valued in Fargus since ancient times. It's far from uncommon for someone to lose their ability to lead their house because they don't bear a crest. Just like Miklon. It happened to my uncle as well. The eldest child of the king. And yet he never ascended to the throne. All families whose bloodlines carry the crests of the ten elites are much the same. But Jesus. House Gautier takes it a step further and absolutely requires an heir who possesses a crest. Why are they so obsessed with it? To that house, the power of crests is a necessity, not a luxury. House Gautier holds the most northern territory in the kingdom, and they have fought with the people to the north for many years. The head of that house is responsible for protecting that territory from fearsome invaders, whom they keep at bay with the power of crests and relics. In exchange for that responsibility, they are granted special privileges within the kingdom. Okay. So their cr crests grant them special privileges? In a way. That said, ability cannot be measured by the possession of a crest alone. I believe that Margrave Gautier was wrong to disinherit Miklana simply because he did not bear a crest. Still, there is always a reason for why such customs stand the test of time. Imagine what this world would be like if no one placed any stock in crests. Bloodlines that carry crests would dwindle. The metaphorical blade used to oppose threats would eventually rust. <sighs> this same argument has been made time and time again across the years. Both sides are at once right and wrong. What do you believe, Dimitri? I believe those with crests and those without should acknowledge the other's strengths and learn to respect each other based on personal merits. And that doesn't apply only to crests. The same holds true for lineage, race, faith, ideologies. If we could just accept each other and make mutual concessions one step at a time, perhaps... <sighs> Who knows if that's even possible. Everyone has something that is unacceptable within them. I certainly do. And I'd wager you do as well. I wonder which is best, Professor. To cut away that which is unacceptable? 
or to find a way to accept it anyway. Hmm. Questions indeed. Probably the second one, honestly. Professor, you have done well to complete such a difficult task. Yeah. You have shown exceptional skill in leading your students. I am forever grateful for the safe return of the hero's relic. Just as I expected, you have mastered the sword of the creator. I've yet to even use the damn thing. Now then, I shall tell you about your mission for the coming month. Re Archbishop. Uh-oh. Seteth, what troubles you? Flane is missing. I cannot find her anywhere. Oh, Professor, shit! Have you seen Flane recently? I have not. I have searched everywhere. Where could she be? She may be in danger. Oh, no, no, no. What am I to do? Calm yourself, Seteth. Professor, we shall continue our discussion another time. Alright. White clouds, horse bow. White clouds. Oh, horse, horse bow. bow moon. Fuck, I tried I tried being Rumors a narrator. Of a reaper. Oh boy. As cold air begins to creep in from the north of Fargus, Fodlin welcomes the riches of fall. The women spend their days reaping the golden fields, gratefully embracing the bounty the goddess has once again provided. The men venture into the wilds with horse bows and empty sacks ready to be filled with game. 5K. Oh, something happens on Monday. On that, sure, I'll speak with you. I'm so sorry, Professor. I somehow overslept and missed our training session. I didn't mean to cause you and the others so much trouble. Imagine if that had happened during one of our missions. It really is inexcusable. You need to rest more. It's just, when I'm studying tactics, I lose track of time and... Oh, who am I kidding? I've always been like this. Before I came to the Officers Academy, I was a student at the School of Sorcery in Ferdiad. Even back then, I was pulling all-nighters well before the exams. And I never even noticed I was harming myself. I'm just too focused on my goal. I know I've already told you this, but I really love to learn new things. It's a passion of sorts. I first realized I had the learning bug when I was about four or five years old. My father was so happy to see me using magic. Seeing him happy made me happy too. And that made me want to work even harder. If only things could have stayed like that. What do you mean? When I was about 13, my father left home. He was a devout man, so I figured he'd gone to the monastery. That's why I went to the School of Sorcery, so that I could eventually get accepted at the Officer's Academy. I studied harder than ever, and sure enough, I finally earned a referral. Unfortunately, my passion for learning became more of an obsession. I got so focused, I kind of forgot how to relax. Feels like I've been running in circles ever since. You're impressive, just as you are. No way! I still have such a long way to go. Still, I guess I'm doing something wrong if I'm working so hard I can't even work hard anymore. Okay, it's decided. From now on, I'll try my best not to try my best. <laughs> You know what? You have my support. Yay! With you on my side, I'm sure I'll succeed. From now on, if you see me going overboard, just let me know. I'm a new woman after all. Okay then. B rank support. Motivated! Nani? As I believe you are already aware, Sedith's younger sister, Flane, has gone missing. At present, all we know for certain is that she has not left Garrick Mach. Flane is not the type of person to just wander off on her own without telling me where she is going. We have searched the monastery thoroughly, but have found nothing. I am now mobilizing the knights to begin searching the town. Troubling rumors have been running rampant lately. I do not wish to consider the worst, but... Troubling rumors. 
There are rumors of someone prowling the streets and attacking innocents night after night. The Knights have investigated the matter. They have not discovered any remains, nor have they found any concrete evidence. The people are panicked. They all insist someone called the Death Knight is coming to claim their souls with his blade. Oh God, I no saw him she earlier. Escaped unscathed if she were captured by such a fiend. Where is she? Seteth, recall that impatience begets error. Please do your best to calm yourself. I think of your sister as family as well. You know that. You have my support. We will devote ourselves fully, mind, body, and soul, to recovering her. Professor, your mission for this month is to help find Flane. The Knights have the town covered, so I ask that you focus your efforts on searching the monastery again. We Alrighty. do not have time to waste. You have your orders. You got it. Flame has disappeared? Seteth must be beside himself. So, finding little Flane is our mission for this moon? Leave it to me, Professor. Chasing after girls is my specialty. Oh my god. Savine, even you must agree that now isn't the time for jokes. I hope Flame is okay. I've heard rumors about some death knight running around town. Sounds intriguing. I have been hoping to cross blades with him. Felix! Please consider how Seteth must be feeling right now. In any case, we must start our search at once. Every moment matters. On your order, Professor. Let's try to collect as much information as we can. You got it. I'm on the lookout for suspicious individuals. The only place I've yet to check is the library. Hmm. We'll go together. As you wish. Candlelight. And who is that? Is it a death knight? No, it isn't. Impossible. Professor, to do. What are you up to at this hour? Your Highness, Dimitri. my apologies. Oh, none necessary. I'm sorry for startling you. I was just doing some research, but I'm just about finished. I didn't realize how late it had gotten. We'd better head back to our quarters to do. Until tomorrow, Professor. All right. Well, Most that was... Most unusual man. Whatever could he have been looking for so late at night? Hmm? That book is quite askew. He must have rushed to put it back upon the shelf. Let's check it out. Well, I'm not gonna stand by my side by myself. This seems to be a record of donations from nobility. Hmm? Arundel. That's not a name I know. But look at that. This Arundel gave quite a sum each year. That is, until the year 1174. Okay. He must have died or fallen to financial woe. Hmm. I can't imagine what this has to do with Flame. I don't think so. Look at those question marks. Hey, it's my birthday! Hey! Hey! So it's Petra's birthday. Let's host a tea party for our birthdays. You have my thanks for giving me your spare time. Of course, we share birthdays. I have gratitude. It's needing sweetness. Yes. I am not in agreement. Damn it! I am so bad at this! Yes. I am in agreement. Yeah! Yes. Alright! I'm not lame. Nice tea time. I will be waiting happily for you to be inviting me again. 
I'm not truly fuck awful. Hmm. All right, you are Archer lad. With tons of studying and lots of shooting people in the dick. You are now in class two. Archer! Oh, what a relief! That's all I got. Cowabunga it is then. I guess we're just gonna explore. Well, onward and upwards, I guess. Hey, Thos, Sothis, what do you think about the situation? Oh my. Just one small girl who's gone astray has caused all this. Yep. We cannot let this stand. You must do all you can to find out where she's gone. Now ask around to see what information you can find. Come now, no time to waste. Fine, jeez. Um, I could run faster. <laughs> I could just fast travel, but where's the excitement in that? Don't I? Yep. There, see? No one's in Bernie's room but Bernie. Maybe Flame just wanted to be alone for a while. Have you considered that? Come to think of it, where is her room anyway? Don't know. Hey, Ferdinand, you know where Flame is at? Beautiful, delicate maiden vanishing into thin air? It is like something out of a book. If it were a book, we would have no need to worry. She would be rescued presently by a dashing nobleman. Is this supposed to be you? Do you have any idea as to where she might be? Where she might have wandered off to? Ah. Uh... Hmm, the greenhouse. Yeah, check the greenhouse. I was just there. That looks appetizing. Yeah, it does. I appreciate any good meal, but nothing beats enjoying my favorite food. Motivated. Okay. So vain, in idiot. Wow. Ingrid just about slapped the teeth out of my head. Oh. All I did was suggest that Flane might have eloped. Is it a possibility? I don't know. I was just suggesting things, and suddenly I was seeing stars and Ingrid was yelling at me. That's not right. Felix. Oh, you're looking for Flane's kidnapper. Yep. I can't say anything for sure, but I do have suspicions about Yuritsa. There's something about how he's handling his blade lately. It seems more impulsive than usual. Hmm. It couldn't hurt to try speaking with him at least. Yeah. At this hour, I think you'll find him sparring with Catherine at the training grounds. I doubt he would uh, be at the training grounds after abducting Flane, but doesn't hurt to check. Guard. Greetings, Professor. Today, there is quite a bit to report. Good work! There is a masked individual who has been going into town every evening and not returning until the following morning. You see? Nothing gets past this guard. I doubt it has anything to do with Flane's disappearance, but... Well, better safe than sorry, I always say. Good work, Jim. I've always believed in you. What brings you here? I'm taking Samir. a break. You have bows. Might as well. Thank you. Let's see. When I consider how Seteth must be feeling, my heart breaks. We must find Flane as soon as possible. I agree. There are no signs of her having left the monastery, but we cannot safely rule out any possibility just yet. Mm -hmm. I'm wasting precious time standing about trying to think of a solution. I'll survey the monastery and see what information I can gather. There must be someone who has a clue as to Flane's whereabouts. 
Will you do me a favor? I hear the monastery is full of secret passages. If there is no sign of Flame's departure, it is possible that she used one of those. That Whatever is a possibility. Is I hope she is all right. Did you hear about Flame? Nothing. It's just one thing after another this year. I swear. Some of the lower ranked knights are searching for her in the town. If they find anything, I'll know. What? Yuritsa? Hmm. Come to think of it, I haven't seen him today. What would make you suspect him? I heard he goes out every night. I see. Well, I'll let the knights know. I will find her. I swear that it. That is all I can ask. Please, lend me your aid. She would never have left the monastery of her own volition. Why is there not a trace of her to be found? I don't think I've talked to Lady Rhea yet. I am more than capable of protecting myself from ruffians, but those around me tend to worry, and I am so often denied the pleasure of a private stroll. It's okay to sneak up sometimes. Fuck! What? Professor. Have you still not found any leads regarding Flane's whereabouts? I have looked everywhere. Not even the knights on guard have seen anything of note. Hmm. Fine together. Yes. Let us work together. It reassures me to have you by my side. May the goddess protect dear Flane until she returns to us. Sounds fun! Let me show you my cooking talent. Okay. A little more secret spice and hey, no peeking. D okay. <sighs> All right. Oh, this takes me back. I used to love this when I was a child. This looks delicious. Let's eat. All right. And now they're motivated! Alright! E plus! I still have much to learn. Indeed. Alright. That's it for now. Please know that the that the current month will end. Oh Jesus! Let's not do that. Might as well. Today's dish was so good. Oh, but not as good as your homemade sweets, Mercy. <laughs> You're too kind. Maybe I'll bake some for you next time, Professor. Motivated. So, your highness, you're gonna keep the scolding to a minimum, yeah? Why are you assuming you will be scolded? Yeah, okay. Professor, you are quick to tire. Good. Nice. All right. I can only battle this day, so next week I can do a seminar. So let's battle for now. Paralogs. Oh shit. Might as well do it. The auxiliary battle will kick my ass. But I got until another month to do it, so. Yeah, 
I'll just do it next one. Let's do this quest. Oh, we're back here again. Oh, God, why did I do this to myself? Whatever. Most of these guys are gonna be physical, so I feel what like should I do? do his best. Stay focused. Ready. I'll give it my all. Here goes. I'll cut through. Oh, never mind. My idea was shit. I'm on it. I'll go. Here we go. Alright, let's do this. Weak. Zero damage. I've deepened my understanding. Freaking the tank. Ow. Saw coming. Damn. Let's fix that. Pew! Pew! That is that. Onward. We ride! Oh, here they come. Tougher than the rest of them. The best of them. There it goes. You weren't ready. Ow. Goodbye and good night. Each battle, a chance to grow. Never doubted you.
though. <laughs> that worked out. Ooh, chest key. Send up the convoy. Damn, you fuck asses. <laughs> no. Damage. Curve a shot. I must steal myself. Not bad. It's so far left to go. Come at me, fools. So suck on my head every time. Here he comes. <laughs> Goodbye. That one is expected. That's so good that you can actually like fall back after you hit him. One of the paces nice do the same as well. Yo, I'm coming in. Watch how I shoot this. Oh yeah. Oh, bitch. Not bad. Pick him off. I believe in you. Alrighty. Over already? Cook this man! Cut his game off. Oh, a, so, you know, it does look like Ezreal's ultimate. It really does. I'm gonna have to repair his bow soon. Boop. He needs a level up. Besides me. And I'm not Dimitri. Yo, cook this man. All right. I must stay focused. All right, Felix. Why am I even here? Oh. Hi. Where'd they go? Come at me! Nope. <laughs> She's like, what the fuck? Ugh. Oh, attack again! Oh, shit! 
Nice. This motherfucker is a tank! Comes. Oh my lord. It Yo, Lance like Breaker. <laughs> Stole it. <laughs> I just wanted to. I thought it'd be funny. What does Sagrate looks like in this game? Oh, okay. Alright, Grid, just smack him. I aim for greatness. Can you just. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's true. What a shot. I won that? You did. Shot him in the face. You did good, kid. Uh, no, I got get to this item. So we can probably sell it later. Ooh, rest of the You have my support. Get him, lads! Time is now. So goddamn hype. What a level up. Stronger. I can feel it. This man has 20 strength. And deleted. Quest complete. Monday, whose birthday? Who's motivated? Almost everybody. All right, there's five of us. Could. He'd be a good Dark Knight, actually. But what is his stats? Never mind. His he no, not magic. No, he butt. He butt magic. Slow up his uh his authority. Nice. I thought this was a test. Good work. All right, that's enough. Motivated. Great. Hey, that was useful. If he gets another great or perfect, we're in there. Or not. That's really just dexterity, really. This raises authority up, then, huh? Nice. This will be useful. Great. This will be useful. Oh man, I three grades in a row. Yep. At least you got it up to E plus. There's so much left to learn. Your dex is actually pretty high up. Is there a class for magical flyers? I doubt it, but. Nope. Might as well get faith up so you can be a powerful, like. What's the class for expert class? Or advanced, a bishop? Or a warlock? And a master class? Yeah. Fucking that class. 
Actually, let's just get this all up and I can just get the other thing up. Good. Great. Nice. Alright, Felix. Wow, perfect with the 99. Of course I got it. I need to butter me up. Crazy, I know, right? Another perfect? Yo, great. <laughs> Yo, sick. Well, that worked out. Quite intriguing. Man. Thank you. Oh man. He's getting there. This could be you. Oh, she's up there in C already. And if she wants to be a Pegasus Knight, she can actually can be. Yeah, she can actually. Cool. Then let's get her authority up. Because the other class. Oh, F. Actually, she needs her swords up. Let's get her sword up. Get up to C at least. It's almost there. Nice. That was Perfect would be good. Wow! <laughs> Perfect timing, holy shit! Big. Almost a C. Alright. And then Dimitri. Oh, fuck! That's it for that day, huh? Group tasks. Uh, ooh, 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 ooh. Have these two do it this time around. Alright. I have a question. Yeah, what's up, Felix? Magic's not my forte, but being a gifted swordsman, I think my time is best served in practicing swordplay techniques. Why should I waste my time attending lectures just to improve my magic skills from mediocre to average? No more magic will make you a stronger swordsman. I see. Yeah! Motivated! Professor. Yeah, sure, you can be a bishop, but... There you go. And this is how you throw magic at Grima. Catherine's birthday. Oh shit. Let's I fuck up with tea parties. Let's just give her flowers. Something happened on Saturday. Ugh, I'm with Ingrid. I'm not gonna get away with anything. Damn. Stop messing around and get moving. You don't work, you don't eat. Oh Fine. no! Let's do this. <laughs> Poor Sylvain. <sighs> Seems we finally finished. That's it. I'm done. No more work for me. Especially not with her. Not in a million years. Well. Almost there. 